Yoru has one of the worst flashes in game. People dodge this flash really easily because it is usually in their enemy's POV for the whole wind up time and also because his activation time is way too long. Now what if I told you? I can use this ability to my advantage just because it is so bad. This may sound absolutely ridiculous but I can assure you in this video, I will be turning the worst flash in the game into a mind jerker. Before I start the guide, it's good to know the characteristics of Yoru's flash. Yoru's flash is called Blindsight and it costs 250 credits. It has an equip time of 0.8 seconds, it travels in the air for 2 seconds at max, its wind up time is 0.6 seconds, the max flash duration is 1.5 seconds, and the flash after contact with the surface travels approximately 5 meters. At the beginning of the video, I mentioned about how Yoru's flash can be easily dodged. Since that is the case, we should take advantage of that. Here's how. One-way flashes are flashes where you're able to peek with your own flash. Using Yoru's avoidable flash, utilizing one-way flashes help you catch enemies off guard while they're looking away, allowing you to gain the advantage over them. I'm bad at naming things, so bear with me. Here are a few examples of one-way flashes. This is the narrow entrance flash. This is the hugging wall where the obstructs flash flash. This is the tossing flash behind me so I can peek with it flash. This is the tossing flash above me so I can peek with it flash. This is the I make enemies think I fucked up my flash but this still works as a flash despite my team flaming me for flashing them flash. All these flashes are examples of one-way flashes and you can easily catch enemies off guard since this flash is really goddamn bad. The goal here really is to bait the enemy to look away so that you can peek and get an easy kill. Similarly to Sky's fake flash but your flash will still pop. I made a guide on the perfect smoke pop flash a few months ago, but after a while, I noticed this actually wasn't the best option. Red briefly explains why here. Dude, I used to do this with the old Yori yeah. flash, but I guess it is fucking, it works. This may be a good flash, but it does have its weaknesses. Yes, it is a 360 flash, so anyone around the smoke will not be able to Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yo, but what if someone's standing right here? Exactly. You can't do this if they're standing right here. It, it's very niche. Don't get me wrong, I still find it a good flash in some situations like 1v1s, but other than that, it team flashes and it doesn't flash to left and right, just like what Red said. So, here's my solution. Yoru's flash travels 5 meters and a regular smoke's radius is 3 meters. Now, I don't want to turn this into a math lesson, so I'll explain this as simple as possible. Yoru's flash creates the line of symmetry upon impact with the ground, and it will mimic the angle it traveled from, so if you aim roughly 45 degrees from you, the flash will bounce 45 degrees from the ground. Using this, I have come up with a pop flash that does flash close left and close right. This flash also doesn't flash your team so that is very pog. Poggers! Stand at the further end of the smoke and roughly aim 45 degrees upwards. If you don't have enough time to position yourself this way, honestly just YOLO the pop and make sure the flash is in the smoke. This may give the enemy more time to react but it's still pretty strong. Bait flashes are not meant to blind anyone. It's a form of outplay in a little more sophisticated way. I've shown bait flashes in some of my videos and they are very effective in mid to high elo. Enemies are unable to see Yoru's flash when they are traveling. Only when the flash comes into contact with a surface, it will be visible to the enemy. Therefore, you can use this to your advantage and toss these flashes at certain areas to make enemies think you are there. Make sure these flashes are hidden to the enemy and all they hear is the sound. If they see the impact of the flash, they will roughly know where that flash came from and... You, you'll get fucked, honestly, like, I'm not even kidding, if you just waste one of your flashes like that, you're just gonna fucking die, so... Yeah, let's play a game. Guess, Guess where the is? Is. is? If you guessed market, you're absolutely fucking wrong because he's behind you! And that is it for the Yoru Flash Guide. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe. For more videos from me, click right here. I post at least twice a week and I stream every day on twitch.tv slash esoteric underscore yoru. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Since, uh, since it's Halloween, and we have to like dress up and shit, today, I'm gonna become your dad. I'll handle this.